30 days ago, this garden was nothing. But a storm revealed something amazing. From the earth emerged, awakening from its slumber, a statue. Contemplate as an old statue is reborn and becomes the center of a fertile and flourishing ecosystem. See how life, art, and beauty emerge where there was only a barren wasteland. It has survived 2,000 years of oblivion. But the real question is, will it survive within our ecosystem? To understand the mystery of life, we must go back to day one. It all began when I discovered partially buried in the garden a small statue. Like an archaeologist, I unearthed it with great care, trying to prevent it from being damaged more. It was the statue of one of the enigmatic Xi'an warriors. But would I restore it without it breaking? I start the restoration process. I must handle it with extreme care because I fear that after so much time underground, it might be fragile and brittle. Once cleaned, I discovered it was in perfect condition. I could use it to build a natural work of art. I'm going to place it as the centerpiece of a mini garden. I don't want to simply place it in a pot and surround it with plants. I'd like to do something different. I'll start by placing a raised slate base above the ground and then layer soil at two different heights. For the first container, I'll use a plastic tray. And on top of it, I'll place a small bonsai pot. I gather soil from the forest, rich with seeds, to fill the pots. I don't know what will sprout. Now I have to wait and trust that some plants will grow. It's been three days since I started watering the pots, and the first sprouts have begun to emerge from the soil. On day eight, the first sprouts had transformed into beautiful white flowers and the garden is starting to take on some color. Days go by. The plants are getting bigger and they begin to cover the statue. All sorts of sprouts have been born, filling the garden with life. But something is eating the plants. I don't know who's causing this, it hides very well. I have to find it as soon as possible or this entire ecosystem will be lost. Finally, I found it. I was expecting to encounter a monster, but I came across a majestic creature instead. I observed it for a while and then returned it to the forest, its home. By day 27, color began to invade the ecosystem. New flowers have bloomed. They open, illuminated by the sunlight, displaying all their beauty. And after the day, the darkness of the night conquers everything. Only the faint light of the moon illuminates the statue's face. Its furrowed brow seems to be reminiscing about old battles. A new day begins, but soon the clouds take over the sky. A great storm threatens to destroy the entire ecosystem. And just when it seemed that all was lost, nature revealed its most precious secret. The beauty of life breaks through in all its splendor, revealing all its magnificence blossoming into a dazzling flower. I started 30 days ago. I wasn't sure if the ecosystem would be able to thrive. And now I know that it has reached the top flourishing, a true work of natural art.